Welcome back to the Gears of War game. This is Robert with you. Trying to decide what to do with Cole. It's Augustus Cole's turn. He's up to full health. Um, his buddy Marcus is has only got one card in his hand, so he's a bit shaky right now. I finally, in the heel stage, drew the roadie run card that I was after, but unfortunately Marcus doesn't have a follow card at this time. So instead we're going to have to do something with attacking. We've got a lot of these advance cards and some explore and scavenging, but I really wish I had a card that would allow me some multiple attacks, but I just don't have it. Well, let's target uh, the Theron Guard with this uh, advance attack. So here's Cole's action. Cole's weapons. How's Cole doing? Well, he's got a, four ammo tokens on his hammer burst. Assault rifle has one but he's out of ammo for grenades and the Scorcher, unfortunately. So maybe it's Hammer Burst time. And let's spend an ammo token. And that's going to allow us to roll four attack dice against the Theron Guard, which will use two for defense. I'm just sort of assuming that the Theron Guard, which is right here, will be the biggest danger, the biggest threat. Here we go. Alright, the defense dice came up with nothing. The attack, I think, turned out pretty well. The omen there on the hammer burst allows you to deal two wounds. So one, two, three, four, five, six. The Theron Guard is completely shot down. Probably a headshot there. Let's see if he drops anything. Yes, he does. <clears throat> we'll put that right there. <clears throat> well, unfortunately, that's about all I can do unless I want to try to move. I can move up to three areas. And I'm just a little reluctant to move away from Marcus, because Marcus is not in good shape. What to do, what to do. Um, maybe it would be good for me to move into that area with the wretches there. Maybe I will do that. I'm going to move one space just so that they don't get any cover and that way I'm still kind of close enough to Marcus that I can get to him. Oops, wrong figure. Cole. Let's get Cole in there. Alright, so I'm just going to move one space and that will end uh, the cog order step. Activation of the AI. Drone time. If a cog figure is within one range, no. Otherwise, move one area toward the nearest cog figure, then attack the nearest cog figure within line of sight. Move one area. Is that right? Move one area toward the nearest cog figure, then attack. Marcus is within line of sight, so here we go. The drone attacks. Three attack dice. This is not going to be so good for Marcus. Alright. I'm going to try to do better with this. Cole. Marcus needs help. Turn around, buddy. Shoot. Guard. Marcus needs help. We gotta drop a card 
to do a guard action. Let's see. Let's drop. Let's drop this one. We're going to use that. We're going to use Cole's ability. He can use any card as a guard card. We're going to spend an ammo token. Uh, no, we're not. No, we're not. I'm going to put that back. Let's just do a regular attack. Because the, th the uh, drone there only gets one die for defense. So it's two to one. And I just got to hope and pray that it's a good roll. Two wounds. Urgh. Not quite good enough to drop the drone. The drone has three health. So what we've done is we have wounded the drone. I'm out of uh, tokens for the drone, so I need to collect all of these that I've used before. And shuffle them around. And draw a new one. So here we go. Don't know what's on the other side. Let's put this under the drone, indicating that he is wounded. All right, I was going to have Marcus guard as well, but I don't think I can do it that in that order. I think what I need to do in uh, this situation normally is have um, Marcus guard first. Then Cole can do it. That's his ability. He can guard even if another player has guarded this turn. But the reverse isn't true. Marcus cannot guard... Uh, following Cole. So I cannot use uh, an attack from Marcus against the drone's attack this turn. So the drone gets its shot. It's three attack dice. And Marcus only has one dice for one die for defense. Uh, this is not good. One wound is cancelled. An omen is going to heal this drone. So this marker goes back in the pile. And one wound gets through wounding Marcus and taking him to zero cards. So Marcus doesn't drop. He's just at zero cards. Another wound will take him down. And that will end this turn.